welcome back to the channel guys hope you're doing awesome i'm doing super awesome and why because we're doing some cool modification on a car which i'm excited about so we are adding finally more horsepower to the car so we are replacing uh um air intake so uh i'm waiting for my buddy to c come over here and uh we're gonna get this project knocked down quick hopefully it would be easy easy peasy i'm not sure but you know hopefully it will go amazing so yeah we're replacing uh air intake on a corsa air intake which this one is not bad air intake but the other one is 100 times better and uh as you could look at the headlight up here um uh, it's hard to set to look, to see, but half of it is covered with the plastic, so it's not fully open. I mean, the whole headlight is open, but up there, uh, there's a plastic is on the way, and it's a halfway open. But with the new one, it's gonna be fully open. Also, this piece right here, as you could see, it's all like rubbery, um, wrinkly pieces up here, which doesn't goes very well with the air flow with the other one it's all open inside and gets more air into your filter so i'm super pumped about this project uh if you guys interested into the uh this uh air intake um you could go on the course uh, um course uh, website and look at it get more information you get 27 more horsepower 23 torque um adds 23 pounds of torque of feet and increases nine percent of uh airflow and here's uh by the whole sniffer himself oh, boy, we'll sniff right here. it's about time my friend let's go get this project knocked it down you got a new exhaust yeah. oh yeah it does it does sound it uh louder i could hear you from over there over there it, it still has the bigger muffler and then the cats in it which <clears throat> it's still on the break-in period still i got you <clears throat> oh you had this thing too yeah i'm taking i want to take off these rear pegs too but I, i'm waiting on that yeah that looks nice so here's the instruction my friend it's all on you because you know you you're good in reading and then follow instruction uh, i can't read it well i'm not good in following instructions we're in luck yeah we have pictures we're good to go if it would be no pictures no you want to bring your bike here because you don't want to sit on the sun? I want the wee wee roast off, huh? Hmm? I like let my wee wee roast. Yes. All right. Should be easy, my friend. I hope so. Um. That was easy. All right. The first thing we're going to do, we're going to disconnect the battery just in case removed it's so dumb how they put the battery back in in the trunk yeah like, i mean i don't like it it makes the engine bay look nice but it's just what do you do when your battery dies yeah i know right yeah. how are you gonna get in the trunk <laughs> i don't think you can crawl through the back can you you can I don't think you can. Yeah. So you want the Camaro? I want. I would like a Camaro. I suppose this one's disconnect. Unplug this. this yeah. on disconnect this. Hold on. Put this. Hold on. Like pull that back. Is there another one underneath? I don't want to like break that thing too. You know what I'm saying? Oh, there you go. And disconnect. Yeah, this one. Yeah, this one easy. Clips you push on them. There you go. Alright. So we got disconnect this. Now we're gonna need to remove that whole um airbox. Yeah, airbox throttle body this part here. So you finally my friend will wanna get come here and get into a mass American muscle cars. We oh, an American muscle cars. Yeah, you all in Japanese crap. 
Turn their torch a bit down. Torch a bit down. Oh, I have it. Hold on. You look. These are different. Uh, let's let's open, let's release these claims from the throttle body first, and then maybe this whole thing just comes off like together. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Instead of taking up piece by piece. car show recently yeah i just um took it like a last week last week ago did you win yeah first place there you go yes nobody else show up or something <laughs> <laughs> no that actually was a lot of cars or is it nice cars um kernsville yeah i wonder if you could just take the whole thing out and done with it like pop this off and just pop this whole thing off yeah because that that just takes apart you know piece by piece my friend i'm i don't playing around taking this freaking there you go you see that what's holding one bolt maybe something at the bottom there you go. You see, we don't need no freaking taking. I use my hand. We don't need no tools. <laughs> How big that was. A lot of room. Got it done, yeah. So, uh, yeah, we took the factory air intake out. Actually, by the way, this is going to be for sale. So if anybody interested. I don't know if we still need this piece or not. Probably not. So now we're gonna install the Corsa air intake. Let me wipe everything down there. Let's take everything out quick and then we'll put everything on the box. The important part right here, stickers. Yes, yes, yes. So now we're doing, uh, we're just uh, getting the box ready. That's extra holes. Here to here, yep. I need to play a little black thing. Yes, my friend, get it. <laughs> <laughs> What's that? Anything else going on? With the car? Yeah. Well, today I got all the trim pieces to Take the gut. Yeah. yeah. That's that's why it looks so empty. But uh yeah, he's gonna do hydro drip on that. And then tomorrow I'm gonna get the window tinted. Uh, I'm not sure how <coughs> how dark I'll go. We'll see. So you can't see the outside. Yeah, and then I'll get pulled over. And here you go, buddy. Here's the two hundred fifty dollars ticket. More than that, probably. No, I'll I'll talk to him. I'll see what he has. You know what kind of uh, dark trim pieces he has. Percent, and then we'll go from there. When are you getting your exhaust? Oh, talking about exhaust, it's it's on sale right now oh, because yeah. of Fourth of July, and if I get it now, I'm saving four hundred dollars. That's not bad. So I'm gonna get it anyways, you know. So I figure I might just get it. Here, my friend, give it to me. Nothing without me. <laughs> I think it's it's pretty good, huh? Just how to spit on it and give a hug to it a little bit, you know? <laughs> yeah, it looks like it's too long, so now you gotta bend it? it down and it crashed. Hold on. Oh I didn't see it has to go down there either good on this edge I might just have to cut it up yeah, just trim it yeah just like like that much maybe uh, use your cranium teeth just bite it off yeah I need a knife my friend all right got the scissors guys 
Wife said bring it back home. All right, we'll do. All right, my friend. Let's cut this piece off. I'd say it's like like an inch. Sometimes. That's not an inch, but okay. You do, do you know what an inch is? You probably More don't know. Than that. That's all you have is an inch. Okay. Stick it in. You have a washer? Out right here. Okay, my friend, it's good. Tight it down. Hopefully this one is good. Oh, I gotta go bigger. Uh, I think it's uh, what, 10 mil? That's three eighths. No, let's try this one. Oh yes, it is one perfect. So you were wrong, my friend. What do you do? Good thing we have pictures. Yeah, you could have messed up my whole freaking engine right now here. One of these things will go in an engine, blows my engine. You buy me a brand new Hellcat. No, you like to blow a train. <laughs> okay, we got done with that. All right. Air filter. That this is right here. Don't tie it up like oh. too much right now. So, damn, this thing is hard to take it out. For real. You hawk too, man. Yes. I mean, it's twisted a little bit. See if you can twist it out, will you? Same time, like I don't want to <laughs> break, break it. it. And then... Because I have to drive the car tomorrow <laughs> for the tent. Man, what a pain. I don't think we need this. We need this part though. It's off. Where's the hose clamp? Got the hose clamp? Yeah. to go that way yeah because it clamps onto the upper part of the filter oh wait a second we oh we need the clamp yeah. yep that's right here this one Put it all gone. You gotta take it all back apart. <laughs> <laughs> Got the clamp, gotta take it all back apart. Man, it's already looking good. Yeah. I like it. I feel like we have to reuse the same bolt. Oh, the there's a big, big, big long one here, yeah. 
Well, this one, we had to reuse it in there. No, 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 this one. This one? You sure it will fit? Yeah. Oh, maybe not. No. <laughs> I thought it would be. You're the one who just dropped the wrench down your car. Is it still there? It hit plastic, so I think it hits in your tray. Damn. Put it down here somewhere. Jeez. You just do one of these numbers and they'll come out. Yeah. Oh, I see it, I see it. If you look from here, you can see the silver. Do you have a magnet? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I see it. Use your skinny leg, the hands in there. There you go. Got it? Nope. To become the dodge. That's yeah, get it, my friend. Jose could throw the wrench in there, and then now we can't get in there. It's all the way at the bottom in the engine. Gotta buy a whole new car. Yeah. You are buying me a new car. Uh, you you, you're the one who dropped it in there, my friend. You're... Got it? Nope. Did you put the freaking pliers? You use the pliers, my friend. I can grab my fingers now. I moved it closer. Um. Take it all back out. Jesus Christ, my friend. What, what if we use that magnet? Give me, give me one more try. Hold on a second. Um, Spit on it and give a hug to it, my friend. <laughs> Here you go. Got it? Power is eating friend. Well, got it? There you go. That's why you guys need to have a skinny guy who could climb it and get it freaking wrench from there. <laughs> Let's put this back on. Which way is it? My friend. Yeah, there you go. All right, guys, so we finally installed the course um, air intake and then absolutely looks awesome. Wasn't bad in, of install. Make sure everything is tight and make sure everything is that not, nothing loose. But uh, I think we're ready, my friend. Yeah. Yeah, the only pain in the ass is this little uh, temperature sensor getting that thing off. Holy crap. Yeah, but other than that, it's just pretty simple. So uh, let's start the car and Check it out. Sounds good. That sounds good. So it she sounds good. Everything looks good. We have no um, any kind of code on a dash. Even the Zach lost the. I shit. lost another rubber piece from the o-ring uh, from the sensor you losing everything man i don't <laughs> it doesn't say in the so there's an o-ring already here yeah and they don't they didn't specify if they wanted both on or just the one but it was tight enough without the other one that it was fine yeah but the fact is that you dropped it uh, wrench in there you dropped the you freaking... dropped the wrench in there watch, no, the, I did watch not. the video watch and, the and then video. he dropped the rubber piece in there so i mean man i don't know the only only benefit from uh, from zach was that he could reach it with his skinny arms and grab the wrench from the all the way to the bottom of the engine but other than that i did all my work by myself here yeah, okay. Okay. <laughs> all righty so the corsa air intakes installed and i'll tell you what carbon fiber air intakes looks amazing absolutely love it and it sounds awesome too it's way way louder as you can see my engine bay is a little bit empty right now because we in the process with the hydro dip um it's getting done so the next video is uh engine dress up so don't mess that video up so we have some pieces missing here we have fuse box trim piece missing uh, wealth cover piece is missing so uh yeah it looks a little bit weird right now but um yeah guys it sounds good it, it looks good so let's hop in in the car and uh we'll go see how she sounds when we are driving the car
really amazing sound it does she does sounds way louder and i highly highly recommend everybody get it done if you have a challenger or a charger because just i don't know if you could hear it on the camera but she sounds good man i tell you it's 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 nasty it's nasty